You know what? I'm gonna play you your favorite song. Do you like it? Hey, what's going on guys? It's Pat and welcome back to another Minecraft video and today we're checking out the dubstep guns mod And guys if you haven't seen this mod before you got to check it out. It's amazing I reviewed this a while ago and today it's actually gonna be an update review It only had like three guns when we first checked it out now There is six brand new ones plus this really cool machine that like combines their powers It's pretty epic so yeah, what this mod does, it has these amazing guns with like super powers and it plays music at the same time. It's a lot of fun to mess around with. So let's get started. So first up for the new guns, guys, we are checking out the circular gun. This one shoots in like a circular area. You probably would have guessed that from the name anyways. So guys, one thing I noticed is most of these do not have recipes. And when I say most of them, I mean absolutely none of them, which is fine for me because they're just fun to like mess around with and creative and stuff like that. So this one, guys, is going to be playing K. Drew Circles. And by the way, the mod creator got permission to use all the different songs in this mod. And when you use it, guys, it's going to use diamonds. It's expensive, but you're going to understand why, because it's freaking awesome. So what I want to do is get, like, a bunch of iron golems. I'll put you guys in, like, a circle or something. And it should be able to hit anything kind of in, like, a circular area. So let's try this out. All you have to do is right-click it, and here we go. Come on guys, that is so sick. That is amazing. So as you can see, it's kind of like an area of effect type of thing. It didn't even use one diamond. So it's only like every 30 seconds or so it uses some ammo. It did serious damage too. Are you guys even mad? I'm gonna, I'm gonna go a little closer. No, they're not even mad, that's cool. So let's try that one more time. Let's kill some more stuff. And you probably already noticed it does not explode the terrain. Some of the other guns like destroy everything. It's really cool. It's hard not to love, like, awesome music and mobs dying at the same time. So this one, you know, it's pretty simple. It kills a bunch of mobs in, like, an area, and it doesn't break the terrain. Guys, we are checking out the focused gun. This one, it's not really for, like, a bunch of mobs at the same time. It kind of just, like, kills one. It focuses on a target. So this one can break the terrain. It can actually break obsidian, which is crazy. So this one, let's have some fun with it. And actually, for this one, guys, you must use Obsidian to shoot it. But as you saw before, I mean, it doesn't really use that much. So the song for this one is going to be Data Life. I, I hope I'm saying that right. I'm really sorry. Rolling Stones t-shirt. It's got a remix for that one. Okay, so Obsidian. And we're going to try to kill some witches and some iron golems. So let's start with a witch. Let's just do this. Let's get it. Look at that. Look at that. That is sick. As you can see, guys, it doesn't do quite as much damage as the other one, but it actually does break the terrain. And I did actually use some obsidian that time. So what I want to do is show you guys this really breaks just about anything. Oh my god, that was instant, instantly through the obsidian. So if you have like a bunch of stuff in the way, take out this gun and destroy absolutely everything. The next one we're checking out is the bat killer. So this one, you can probably already guess, it's good for killing bats because they fly everywhere. This kills everything in front of you. It doesn't do a ton of damage, but a lot of mobs can go down quick. So for this one, guys, I can't even read this. Adhesive Wombat Rocket Science. It's really not in a good color, as you can see. But this one, guys, it is going to cost you blocks of redstone. That is expensive. Luckily, it doesn't use it too much. So what I want to do is, why did I put creepers in here? I've got no idea. Let's start with some bats. Let's try to get a bunch of these and use it for what it's made for. Alright, I'm gonna get a bunch, like tons and tons of bats, and let's try to kill them. Look at that. It really killed everything, like, instantly there. So check this out, guys. We're taking out creepers with it now. Let's do it. Seriously, they went down a lot quicker than I thought they would. So guys, for the buttons, I mean, it's pretty simple. You right-click to start it, and you can right-click to stop it. And also, you can kind of just scroll away on the taskbar if you want to as well. But this one, it does not break the terrain. It kills mobs. Definitely, when there's like a giant amount coming after you, it's going to be really helpful. You got to check this one out, guys. It's my favorite by far. It's the mining gun. So pretty much, you can mine instantly. It's awesome. I really love it. So no recipe once again, sadly. I'm sure they're going to add some in, though. This one is Adhesive Wombat Nightshade, and it uses coal, which is no problem because you get, like, millions and millions of coal as you're using it. 
So I'm gonna go back into survival here. I guess what we're gonna do is kind of just break through the ground. I don't know if it can break a tree. Let's try. Does it? It does. All right, let's go mine it, guys. Let's do this. All right, let's see what we actually got from that. As you can tell, though, I mean, this thing is a beast. I'm pretty sure if I just, like, target this coal, let's go for it. It's gone. So I can just pick all this up. It doesn't actually, like, blow up the block. It lands on the ground no matter what. So, oh, look at this. We got nine iron. I got all kinds of stone. You can get building materials in, like, ten seconds. And you could go mining in, like, two minutes. This could be, like, really helpful. I feel like we should do one more test with the mining gun. So let's say you get attacked by an evil witch while you're mining. Does it kill it? Does it? Does that hurt? No. All right, so mobs are not affected by this one at all, but the terrain definitely is. You can get so much stuff so quickly. All right, guys, so now we're checking out the void gun. And this one, it breaks obsidian, but not bedrock. I was kind of thinking it would because, you know, it's like the void gun, void. But actually, what it does, it sucks up blocks completely. It's pretty cool. So if you don't want, like, a huge mess in your area, this one is perfect. But you can't go into the void if you want to. It would be pointless anyways. All right, guys, so for this one, it is actually going to cost you soul sand to shoot it. And it's Floyd Beats Sick Drops. So I'm going to grab this. We'll get some soul sand. And I'm going to try it on Bedrock and Obsidian. I tested it out a ton. You could, you could already tell here. A little bit messy in the area now. So what I want to do is get out some Obsidian. Let's bust it out. Let's get out some Bedrock. And let's destroy this and listen to some awesome music at the same time. That is insane. It literally cleared out like this entire area in a few seconds. Plus there isn't like a million blocks around. So I'm thinking like if there's like a giant hill next to your house, you could probably just take the entire thing out. It's pretty cool to mess around with. But also guys, it can be used to kill mobs. So let's test it out on a witch. You know what? I'm going to play your favorite song. Do you like it? So as you can tell, guys, I mean, this one is pretty powerful. It takes out mobs, pretty much all the terrain, and doesn't even leave a mess after it. We're actually on to the final gun now, and this one is called the Yogg's Gun. This one's a little bit different. It lights the area on fire instead, so there isn't, like, giant explosions and stuff like that. So, guys, it says right here, this one is from Bebop Vox. That is a YouTuber, so I'm guessing this is his song, Diamond Steel. That's pretty cool, actually. This one consumes a potato, so very important ammo for this one. And what I want to do is get, like, a bunch of zombies and just light them on fire. I got a bunch of zombies. We got to start this before the iron golem kills everything. All right, here we go. Oh, I got to say, the particle effects on this one are probably my favorite. I know you guys already noticed there's like awesome particle effects on every gun, but this one is completely amazing. Look at this. It's so cool. It's like completely different destruction too because it just lights a gigantic fire, which can be really good for fighting off like hordes of zombies and skeletons. So guys, before we jump into like the awesome machine in this mod, I did want to show you these guns look amazing. So let's get a better view. They're huge. That is a really big gun. Let's switch back and forth between them. So this one, Yogg's gun, bat killer. Mining gun, circular dubstep gun, focus gun, and void gun. So these things are huge. They've got 3D models. I believe if you throw them on the ground, they literally land on the ground. Look at that. They look so sick, too. I mean, these are some of the coolest guns I've ever seen in a mod before. I'm just going to toss every single one down. Looks awesome to me. We've got one more thing to check out, and this is actually a work in progress, but it's really cool. It's probably considered cheating in survival, though. So this, guys, is the dubstep gun pedestal. So to make it, there actually is a recipe for this one. It's going to be iron ingots, a redstone comparator, a glass pane, and also a weighted pressure plate. So I'm going to grab it. I'm going to get, like, three guns and show you exactly how it works. So basically, you put this thing down. It's kind of cool. You right-click it. This interface opens. And at the moment, everything is completely free. I guess that's a good thing. So what you want to do is take a gun. Let's get the first dubstep gun here. We'll put it in. And now it's going to basically, like, put all the information into here. So I can't switch this. But once I put in more guns, you can actually, like, change the attributes of any gun you want. So now I'm going to take it out, guys. I'm going to put in the explosive gun. And you're going to notice if I hit music, I can actually switch it between those two. So I can actually change the music. I can change the power if there's, like, a power difference. 
I can make them explosive and stuff like that. So I'm going to take this one out. Let's put in um, the Yogg's Gun now. Let's try this. So now you can see there's actually like three different songs. There's like different colors I can use. I can change the power now. I can make it weaker or stronger. Explosive. I can switch that on or off. Same with like fires, with focusing, and with hurting. So what I want to do, guys, is make this gun amazing. I'm going to take the first dubstep gun. I actually reviewed this one in my first review, guys. I'll leave the link down below for that. I'm going to toss it in here. And now what I want to do is switch stuff. So I'm going to put on like a different song. We'll go with like, we'll go with Love Story. We'll go with that one. And the color, I'll make it pink. I'll change the power. We'll make it stronger. And we'll make it explosive. It's got to be green if you want it to be like on. And I can't change the, oh, we'll make it fire. I can't change it. We'll make it fire and explosive. More powerful. It's going to be amazing. So all I have to do is hit apply. And in the future, guys, there will actually be a cost for this. So now you're going to notice it actually says modified. So when I try it, it should blow stuff up. It should start fires. And it should be a completely different song. So it's pretty cool that you can do this. All right, let's go for it. All right, chicken. It's going to be fine. That is so freaking sick. So I basically turned it into a gun that explodes, is super powerful, and starts fires at the same time. So as I was saying, it's probably not really that fair for survival, but it's going to be amazing once they actually like finish it off. Because right now it's kind of a work in progress and doesn't work perfectly, but still very cool. So yeah, guys, that is about all there is to show with this mod. Awesome guns, cool music, tons of destruction. How could you not love it? It was awesome. I love the mod. Hope you guys did too. If you want to check this one out, the download, as always, will be in the description. And if you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to punch the like button in the face. It was an awesome mod. I might even like the video. I really like this one. This was really cool. Haven't seen this mod in a while. Anyways, guys, be sure to subscribe if you love Minecraft. I put up all kinds of content all the time. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.